So, so what is asthma? Uh, it can be confused with many other conditions and if it's not recognized properly, the treatment can often be wrong as well. Let's just look at the, at the asthma symptoms. They can be a cough, shortness of breath, or an audible wheeze. And those three symptoms can all be made rapidly better with a bronchodilator or more slowly better using anti-inflammatory medication. Let me just take each one of those symptoms in isolation. The cough of asthma is typically worse at night or when the weather's cold. In some people it occurs soon after exercise, um, either while the exercise is in progress or often five minutes or so after the exercise has stopped. The cough is also typically prolonged when a person gets a viral respiratory tract infection. So when everybody else has already got over theirs, an asthmatic will be coughing for another two or three weeks afterwards. The shortness of breath of an, of an asthmatic um, typically causes prolonged expiration and uh, can also occur in the same settings as the cough, which I've already mentioned. Um, let's look at the, at the shortness of breath and the wheezing. Um, an asthmatic will often literally struggle to get their breath. They have more problem getting, their, getting rid of their breath than getting it in. So they have a prolonged expiration and this audible expiratory wheeze that goes... <laughs> We're not talking about stridor. Stridor is an inspiratory noise like this. And that typically occurs in children who've got croup. And the two mustn't be confused. Um, that, that audible wheeze and the shortness of breath, again, are typically rapidly improved using a bronchodilator in the form of an inhaler or some sort of, of uh, nebulization.